right before we came back. Wow, oh wow, oh wow, wow, we love Frankie C. If you get a chance, check out JiggyJaguar.com right now. Coast to coast and border to border. We're like coast to coast like butter and toast, as I say. And um, I don't know why they're saying it, but they're saying it. Dollars to donuts, and I think James brought the donuts. We're going to get it going. Um, <laughs> if you check us out on JiggyJaguar.com, we've got our live stream up uh, right there if you want to watch us. I don't know why other people watch other people do talk radio, but they do. Um, you can follow us on Twitter, Facebook, Ping, um, YouTube, uh, Flickr, if you enjoy people taking pictures and looking at them. Uh, MySpace. Yes, I'm still on MySpace, even though no one else is. Um, the newsletter as well. And uh, what the hell's going on here? I'm hearing, I'm hearing things. What the hell? Okay. Um, oh, yeah, it's a, it's a radio show, and there's music in my headphones. Okay. Um, Turn up my headphones! Nobody gets that because I don't know if they remember Dave Chappelle. <laughs> Dave Chappelle show, the, the deaf rapper. Turn on my headphones! <laughs> uh, we got a, wow. our, our monthly poll at JiggyJaguar.com. Uh, does Ross Long from RossLong.info look like Dr. Phil? Go over to JiggyJaguar.com and vote yes or no. This question was inspired by our friends Beast Mode, We the Mode, Free My Mama. Um, does Ross look like Dr. Phil? And if you're on live stream right now, you can see uh, Miss, Mr. Ross Long, the rabble rousing ringleader, the Michelangelo of video, the what the hell else are some of the others that we've. Got? I'm not as fat as Dr. Phil. And you're not sending Ted Williams to rehab either. But I tell people that they're bad. Bad! Yeah, that is kind of funny. He's been famous for a week and he's Ted Williams, man, going to rehab. And what's great is I've seen on. And I hate to confess this. Ted Williams? The Entertainment Tonight. Isn't he dead? Didn't they freeze him? No, that's baseball's Ted Williams. Oh, okay. they, they, he's dead. They froze him, chopped his head off, and his head and, is and then cryogenic. And now they're, frozen selling him, that, now they're selling the DNA. Yeah, yeah. Uh, have your own Ted Williams. Um, have your own baseball team full of Ted Williams. Um, but when Ted Williams got to rehab, some other rehab facility, before he went in, offered him $20,000 to go to another rehab facility, and he was going to take it. And their, his agent said, no, 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 you can't do that. Dr. Phil is paying for the rehab that you're going to now. So people are fighting over sending this guy to rehab. In the words of the great philosopher Amy Winehouse, they tried to send me to rehab. And no, I say, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> they want to go to rehab. Um, <laughs> of course, uh, uh, Ross is, is known as the Michelangelo video, uh, Dr. Phil's doppelganger, um, the $5,000 man himself. Um, Big Ross, the freshly expurgated Ross Long. That's which, wearing old, yeah. That's wearing old because Access kicked you out how long ago? Mm, about four months ago. About four months ago, yeah. The rabble rousing well, ringleader. Months, five months ago. And, um, five months ago. F- five minutes ago they kicked you five out. Five months ago. Oh, five months ago. They let you back in and they kicked you out five minutes ago. Um, this segment of the world famous Jiggy Jaguar, you show brought to you by our good friends at the uh, something. I don't have a sponsor plug. I should have it up and running. Gimby Goose? Gimby Goose. We, did we didn't earlier. do Gimby Goose, or did we? I didn't Gimby Goose earlier. Oh. Uh, oh, hell, let's go for it. The Muse Ballroom this Friday. There you go. Uh, Bart Crow Band, live is only live can get with uh, Shotgun Sons. Uh, yes, another person from McPherson is coming up for me to interview. Um, what, Mark, Yes is coming to Salina? Yes. Yes? Yes is coming to Salina. They are from McPherson, Kansas as well. No, they're not. <laughs> what? Yes. The band, Yes. Yes, it's not Owner of a Lonely Heart, that one. Those yeah. guys? Uh, <laughs> I want to hear a rap version of it. <laughs> I want a Seasons After Tribute Band. I want somebody that to come That was my up idea. With I know. Ross Ross wants a Seasons, a seasons After Tribute Band. Because uh, the real Seasons After, from what I've heard, well, there's some issues. But we won't get into that here. Um, let's see. We've got Jessica Lewis with us, who is not in a tribute band, who is a barista or... What was it you said earlier? Barista? Barista? Barista. 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 It's Italian, so it has to be yelled. Barista! Barista. Aren't you really just a cashier? Me?
So what's the weirdest thing somebody's asked you of a non-perv sense? Okay. Of a non-perv sense. That's really uh, yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. First of all, because Mocha's, you're at Mocha's. Yeah. Two. I, like I know. <laughs> <laughs> you got to deal with Gary Schwarzenegger on a daily basis, and uh, yeah. see who else. Uh, David Ed Norlin. Baldwin. Diamond Dave Norlin. Ed Baldwin. Ed Baldwin, my buddy. <laughs> if anybody knows my history with Ed Baldwin, Miles Edward Baldwin. The current member of the board of directors from Community Access Holding of Salina, Inc. Inc. <laughs> but go I ahead. The um, oddest thing that's been asked to you in a non pervy sense. I have a lady that comes through the drive thru and has some very particular things that she likes. And one day she brings me a cup and it's halfway full. And I'm thinking this is. She just wants to be topped off. Or is it half empty? <laughs> <laughs> That was my urine sample. <laughs> no, it was liquor. It was half full of Oh, my God. And I poured out. Jim Beam at the Mocus. <laughs> Super Dave. <laughs> you owe me half a bottle of MD 2020 now. <laughs> That's right, <laughs> Jessica Lewis, the Queen of Public Service. That's her brand new name, and we will use that the next time she's in here to do her acoustic thing. We will. Uh, she is. She is Jessica Lewis, the Queen of Public Service. Much like Sick and Twisted is. I don't know. Sick and Twisted. I don't know. Do you guys have have a gimmick? Is, do you have like a, a a slogan? I mean, I don't know. Nah, not really, man. <laughs> There's I mean, no I, slogan. I guess I guess you could say. Uh, the illest rap is on the scene. I don't, know, like, I don't, don't know. get it sick and twisted. You know what I'm saying? Like, there you, you know, go. Like right. Don't get it twisted. Don't get it twisted. Yeah. It's then, it's like an underwear uh, uh, <laughs> reference. Could it be? <laughs> 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 uh, <it's hard. laughs> You, you, you know what we need, and then and then we've got we've got uh, what would be Psychic Cynthia's tagline? Psychic Cynthia, the the the, the best damn psychic on the block. I don't know. <laughs> the best damn psychic on the block is that it? The the the, 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 the when when. Considering we're across the street from a jail. Maybe Psychic Cynthia. Uh, your spiritual mentor or something. I don't know. I've, 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 I've got to get all... I, I, and then we got James, who's just James. She's got her own website. <laughs> and then we've got uh, Jody, who is Metal Mom. Yeah. So we, we, she, we, she doesn't need a tag either. Do you have a son or daughter in the heavy metal industry? What's that? Do you have a son or daughter in the heavy, heavy metal industry? She's great. She's great. Actually, when I started going to Metal Bomb, I love it. I don't know how that happened. Um, hippie started it. It's <laughs> that <laughs> damn hippie. <laughs> Blame that <laughs> damn hippie. <laughs> Uh, take that brand recognition. <laughs> Look at that. Well, you know what's great is Mark Beamer, sound guy, world famous sound guy. Uh, looks like a, a Wookie. Um, the <laughs> it looks like Zach Wild. Only more successful. I mean, I shouldn't say these things, but. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, he told me one time. He said, "You know, Jody." I said, "Yeah," and he goes, "Metal Mom, she is the only person in this industry in the local scene that scares the crap out of me. That woman would would die for this heavy metal stuff." And 
<laughs> so, you know, it's 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 kind of like it's kind of like you know Bruce at the rap shows. You know, he throws the rappers money and he throws everybody. Money. He throws everybody money. <laughs> Has he ever thrown you money, Jessica, when you were with the Liquid Kids? That's me. Okay. She grabbed it. She grabbed it. No strings attached. Nirvana, the 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 Nevermind, the Nirvana tribute band, they kicked the money back at him. Oh. oh like, what are you doing? Those are fifties, pal. That's probably gonna, and especially due to the fact they were that probably, was, especially you know, due to the thinking, fact it was done during the Kevin Hardison years. That's probably gonna be the only. They were probably thinking tonight. like you, Jessica. They, <laughs> that that Bruce would be expecting sex from it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, here's fun, something funny. Halloween. <laughs> Thank you, Samus. Yeah. <laughs> Halloween. Samus from that on Turn transition. That, is that mic on? A year or two. Yeah, speak into it. Can I speak into it? There, there you go. go. Okay. Um, I don't think it was this Halloween. I think it was last Halloween. I was dressed up as the Geico Gecko. Okay. And <laughs> oh, and Bruce, God, I want pictures of that. And Bruce was there, and he thought I was real, and oh, he started talking to me about insurance. <laughs> Sounds about right. Come on, yeah. baby. I got to get to a concert. <laughs> I don't know the boat, but I need boat insurance, too. I need boat insurance, baby. He always, calls everybody, everybody, he bicycle? He always calls everybody baby. Yeah. Hey, baby. Yeah. I saw you on TV. Can you give me a discount on insurance? And I, I just looked at I want that conversation. Yeah, okay. Right up, whatever. <laughs> There, there's a really good, uh, really good friend of mine who's a waitress out at uh, Gutierrez here in Salina, and uh, she... Uh, found Bruce last week and she's like hey give me some lottery numbers so he spit her out some lottery numbers and she went and played them in all sorts of different order and we were really hoping it would win she'd win something because then Bruce could be like sought after and he could like do like those those bookie commercials where he's like call me up I'll give you what, what five points on the Jets this week and he could do all that <laughs> <laughs> call me up for my quick five tips and he, he could build a whole brand around him being a sports betting guy. <laughs> he'd be like, and if you call me now, I'm going to be able to give you uh, the horse races and uh, Major League Baseball all for free. <laughs> Coming right now, baby. <laughs> so, <laughs> but uh, we, we, have, we have come to our, uh, to, to our end of the broadcast. Um, I want to thank Ross Long, the Rabble Rousing Ringleader, for once again uh, helping us out on the live stream and the, the, the Skype, or as Chris Matthews from MSNBC calls it, Skip. And uh, Ross is actively doing something over there. I don't know. I'm playing with it. Don't worry about it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we've got, uh, don't bug with me. <laughs> We've got we've got James and Jody. I want to thank you guys for swinging by and giving us the taproot information. That was a uh, that was fun. Jody, I hope I hope you enjoyed your time here today. And Cynthia, this has been your first time here. Yeah, first time here. I really enjoyed it. Uh, this has been a lot of fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Cynthia, why did you come? Because I asked her to. You asked her to, and you just like spent twenty dollars in gas, just came up here to see Probably you. Probably more like on the forty, show. and he stalked me. <laughs> <laughs> I, wanted, I wanted her on the show, and I wanted I wanted to do this special little deal. You were tired of calls and emails and all the, really, the stuff. From I understand, you know, Facebook. You know, I, the stalking took place through Facebook. That is true. I so. love Facebook. 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 Yeah, Facebook. <laughs> it's beautiful. And uh, I just thought I'd come back and relive the old days. You know? that's, that's probably the reason you have to get, you know, three restraining orders a week against yeah, people. You, because of Facebook, <laughs> right? <laughs> and uh, <laughs> Second Twisted, thank you for coming by. Yeah. Uh, thanks, thanks for bringing Mr. Cortez in. Yeah, yeah. The big Hola. stuff. And uh, management back here. He just he just hung out the whole time, did what management does, and that's watch everybody else do their job. And we're going to go, hear hey, from you all else? when, where? Yeah. Is there is what? there a new thing? Is there um, a new well, my my mix is thing? coming out uh, late February. I mean, we're trying to get it all mastered and done, but still being on the works. Um, I know C he has a few projects he's working on. I'm gonna let him talk about that. 
Uh, yeah, we got we got a couple projects coming up, man. Uh, we got a concert that we're looking to be doing here pretty soon, hopefully in Salina. We got to talk to cool. a couple of heads, you know how that goes. Um, and I uh, got a couple singles coming out, man. Lil Smoke, uh, he's got his new single called Wondering Why. Um, so it's a good track to check it out, man. ReverbNation.com. Uh, that's where you can find a lot of the Sick of Twisted music, updated videos, sh shit like that. Um, <laughs> we got a music Just video. Had to do it at the end of the <laughs> broadcast. Yeah, like, we, got, we, got, we got a music video coming out too, man. So uh, you know, just keep your eyes open for Sick of Twisted, man, because uh, you know we want to come up, man. 2011, it's gonna be a start to a new year, man. We're gonna do it real big, so. You following your boys, Sonic Can 75, take a twist. They're going to take it in the 20 teens. And as for Jessica, Jessica her, her, you have her plans after, after this show is to uh, come over to my house. Do you ever want to be on this show ever again? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> We have to apologize to our UK and German listeners who struggle with English and did not see a porn star. That's why I, I got no, I got the boot shots. I really of, was hoping uh, of Jessica and oh. Psychic Cynthia. <laughs> That's nice. Was <laughs> I was I was really hoping I could get to reveal this introduction of Mia Isabella, but maybe we'll do it next time. Yeah, hopefully we'll we'll be able to salvage her. Uh, or it's not too late. Savage her or well, I'll get into that here. Uh, yeah. Everybody knows what's going on. out to the smoke. I reveal the information. We will. Uh, oh, <laughs> we will. I'm gonna read this intro off air because this is hilarious. Uh, we we're, we're, we'll we'll chat with you next week. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, it is now time to do this. The big show is over. Konnichiwa, bitches. Well, thank God for that. Here's the end of the Cheeky Jaguar show. We get together like this every weekend. My thanks to Lisa Snyder from Rockfist Magazine. Also, the guy from Cigarex, uh, Psychic Cynthia, James, Jody, Sick and Twisted, Mr. Cortez, the lovely right, Jessica right. Lewis, the, what was it, James? The, that's right. And uh, rabble rousing ringleader Ross Long. Greed is good. Greed is right. Greed works. It's the weekend. I want to thank everybody for joining us this week here on the world famous Cheeky Jaguar You Show. And we will see you next week. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna do all sorts of cool things next week. And uh, don't forget to vote for the best and the worst. Yes, best and the worst show at basementradio.net. Goodbye. 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 Excuse me. Goodbye. Good night. Signing off. Come to bed now. Okay. Email okay. us at Jiggy Jaguar at Jiggy That was me when I was still married. Um, well, we've got more. <laughs> we'll get back next week here on the World Famous Jiggy Jaguar Show. Look at that. You knocked out Jesus. You knocked out Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I hit the light switch. I hit the light switch all at the same time. I love it. That's great stuff. Well, folks, thank you for doing this. I hope, uh,